time it is time to put this into action you'll be using you will be work will be playing the game this uh this last time there were some problems so i think that this time you're gonna get even better at this okay okay we're still going to be working in partners listen carefully each one each two people like partners each two people will be receiving oh, i need your eyes and your ears i can because i know you know what's going to happen i can hear some of you say miss cosio what do we do what do we do Two people will be receiving. Look, I changed the color to make it fun. And then um, you'll have 15 beans, a die, a die. Do you mean that? Oh. Die? No, no, no. We're gonna a die, which means no. This little. What shape is this? A cube. Cube with numbers. Yes, a die. Plural dice. And you'll be also receiving squares. Um, I need to review this because last time some of you were making you were, uh, were making some mistakes. You roll the die. Remember, roll the die, and the number that you get that will tell you how many how many plates. Let's pretend these are plates or dishes. Yeah, how many plates you will put them out, put them out. Those are going to be the groups. Yes, Alexis. And then, Jacobo. And then the beans will get divided as equally as possible. And after you're done with that, what happens? Remember what we did last time. You need to ask one of you. You get to decide who's A or who's B. I leave that up to you. You decide and you ask the question then you answer and then you switch hmm? I'm, I beg your pardon you can choose your partner yes I need to see though I need to see sticky high fives so I know who you're going to be working with you need to stand up and find find your partner find your partner you may start you may start going you may start going. I want to hear you say no the que the question and the answers. Let's see. Six. What does that mean? Six plates. Open them up. Spread them out so you have enough room. You got fifteen. Fifteen. You only got fifteen. We only got fifteen. What? No, you don't have to have twenty. She can do it too, also. Help together. Oh, look who's happening. Look what's happening. I'm coming. I'm gonna come to help out. Okay? I'm gonna just do it, your, do it yourself. I'll be there. I'll be there. Oh, look what I noticed. Now, okay, check and see, make sure that everybody has enough or equal amounts. I like how you checked counting. That was very bright of you, making sure I do the same thing. So, did we divide the, the beans equally? Did we divide the beans equally? Look, two, two, two. Yes. So now you're ready to say it. Who's going to be A and who's going to be B? I will be B. I will be A. Good. What do you say? What does this That's what mean? Down. This means 15 divided by 6 equals 2. With the, with the remainder of 3. three. Okay, take one, put it there. Now, now you took this, take this one and put it there. One for him, 
one for me. Then you say the same thing. One for me. And you say one. One. Say it. One for me. See? Now stop. Do you have equal amount? So, so far, how much do you have? How many? How many? Yes, there you go. So keep going. One, four. Eight. How many do you have? Seven. Oh, so he has one, two. He has one too many, right? Count it again. I know. Leave him alone. He's organizing the beans, see? He's organizing the beans. Now, are they in order now? Now they're easy to count, right? I agree with you, sir. Ooh, ooh. Is that fair? That's not fair. So, now, you're going to give it to him? Okay, how many are you going to have? Seven plus one? Eight. Eight. How many do you have now? Seven. Is that fair? Does that mean that are we did? Yes. Put it away. Set it aside. Are you ready to say that? Are you ready for your dialogue? What does this mean? This means... Um, Remember the... Mm, what was the, the amount that you started with? Uh, uh, Vanessa, Vanessa, seven, don't be disrespectful. Seven and the remainder of one. You got it. See? See how fun this can be? Uh, clean again your beans and play one more time. See how good you can be? I know you're learning a lot just by doing this. It's like you're playing and at the same time you are, you are working. Richard, Richard, can you imagine um, having to do this when you grow older for your workers? If you work, let's say, if you have a job and you want to buy cookies for your workers and you want to make sure that you want to divide the cookies equally to all your employees, you will have to do division. See? Pretty cool. So try again. Roll the die. Okay, what do we have going on here? We got a family. You got a family. Hmm. So how many members in the family all together? Well, that's the number we started with. All together. All together. One, two, three. Fifteen. Okay, let's double check. One, two, three. One, two, three. Uh-oh. One, two, three. One, four, five, six. 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 12 13, 14, 15. We have three reminders. Okay, so what is the big number at the beginning? How many did you start with? How many beans did you start with? 15. 15. So, what does this mean? 15. Divided by 4 equals 3. With... With the leftover Look. Three Remi reminders of three. Remainder of three. With the remainder of three. And you're writing it down. That's gonna be my next step is to ask you for your whiteboard. <laughs> okay, Angela. One for this one, one for this one. Help. <laughs> well, you chose to sit like this like that. <laughs> Keep going, keep going. <laughs> so far, so good. Even? They're all even, right? How many does, does each one have so far? Two. Can we still divide these? Ooh, I think we have to stop here, right? Now you are ready for the dialogue. Who's going to be A and who's going to be B? I don't know what white horse. Oh, she's going to get it. She's
She's gonna get it. Two with three leftovers. That's wonderful. That's it. With three leftovers, or we can say with the remainder of three. three. Now you're ready for another round. <laughs> can you imagine doing this when you are when you're older and you have your kids? You would need to know how to do division. You would need to know how to do division when you have you have your kids and you bring them like the jelly beans or when you bring them marbles and you want all your, your kids or your, to have you know, the same, same amount. amount. You got it, yes, you need to know how to divide. You're set, ready to go. Okay, so what do we have here? Jacob, count how many beans here? Seven, how many here? Six. One, two, three, four, five, six. So if this one has six and that one has seven, you need one more there. Okay, count again. Brian, count. Put them in order like this. Okay, count. Seven. Count how many you have here. Put them in order. Remember your number, Brian. Seven, okay? How many you have here? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So have they been divided equally? No. How many do you have? Oh, seven. Oh, seven. How many does he have? Seven. Seven. So have they been have they been divided equally? Yes. Seven and seven? Yes, because seven is the same as seven, right? Equal seven. So you're ready for the dialogue. Who's gonna be A and who's gonna be B? A. Okay. What does this mean? This I'm an ice cream machine. I'm an ice cream machine. Fifteen. 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 Fifteen to put your material away. I heard some great conversations when you were working with your, um, with your division problems. So before we go, there's a couple of things we want to do. And before I let you go, I want you to think and tell me. I'll be your scriber here. A scriber is a person who takes notes, like a secretary. I want to know all the different I want to know all the different words that come to your mind. I'm going to be deep thinkers. So right now you're being mathematicians because we've been working with numbers, but also um, good thinkers, great thinkers because I want you to think about all the okay. different all the different words that come to your mind. When you see the word division, or when you hear your teacher say, today, boys and girls, we are going to work on division. What ideas come to your mind? What is it that you think? Um, mm -mm. This is thinking time, OK? Thinking time. I'm getting ready. I'm g getting ready for some great words that I'm going to hear. Be, please be patient, because I know that you are going to be bombarding me with words, and I don't write that fast. Yes, even for ELD, same thing. So, think about it. What are some of the words that come to your mind when your teacher says, today we're going to work on division? <coughs> I like this. I'm ready. Is that what comes to your mind? 14? I can't think when I hear those noises. 14, OK. What else comes to your mind when, when division? Mm. Christian? Um, equal sets. Equal sets. Are you looking at how I write the words? 
that's important too. Equal sets. sets. Space here. Sets. Sets. Oh, I see plural word right there. Plural word. It's not just set, but it's also set.